back from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a nozzle design, and it's in particular from a pattern, a pattern with transparency. And the pattern design is from a Graphic Extras, so I'm just going to use, but of course, you could use other patterns with transparency. Now, file open, and I'm going to be using a Nutcracker design from Graphic Extras. I'm just going to select that now. I'm just going to select first load selection. And this is just a run through I just like to do. Load selection, select, save selection. So you've actually got the selection saved. Definitely got the selection. That's the key thing for a nozzle, that it's actually got a selection. And for Painter 12. So next thing to do is just go over to the layers over here, layers. And you will see the canvas. Set the canvas on. So there's actually the canvas has now been set on. Otherwise, if you do drop all, suddenly it all just disappears. So next thing, go over to a layers, drop all. Now you'll see here you've actually got the canvas, you've got the selection there. Now go to File, Save As, and just save it as a RIF file. So I'm just going to save it as a RIF file. Obviously done this earlier, so just click Save As, Save. Yes, I want to replace that. So I'm just going to get rid of that now. Now go to Nozzle Library, this is the Nozzles section, you can find that via the Window menu, Nozzles, this. there, Nozzles. Right, once you've got the Nozzle Library, just go over to the right side, Load Nozzle, that's the next thing, just select that one, that's the RIF file, click Open, and it'll come up with this Nozzle definition, so you just you obviously go with this default settings it's nothing there's no different rank or rank 2 rank 3 it's just a rank 1 click OK right it's actually been stored now I'm just going to add it also I can add it to the library add nozzle to the library lots of people like to actually have it within the library itself and there you have you can actually see the nozzle down here but now just so obviously I'm just applying that that's the one that was there before not so useful just click the actual nutcracker and you can apply it there. Of course, as always, you've got all the different image hose settings which you can apply to rotate the design and much more. Okay, hope you found this tutorial of interest. Thank you very much.